So statistics on truck drivers and particularly on North American truck drivers. In today's video, we're going to see stats that we were able to collect in regards to interesting topics like divorce and trucking, income and passive income amongst truck drivers, engines and transmissions, and lastly stats on what videos are mostly watched by truck drivers. So let's get started. Our first topic, divorce amongst truck drivers. 2,800 divorced truck drivers participated in this poll. So the first question asked is, what, would the, what was the reason behind the divorce? So 82% of those 2,800 divorced truck drivers said that the reason for the divorce was because of the amount of time that they spent away from home. 9% of them said that the reason for the divorce was because of their spouse was cheating. 3% said that they weren't making enough money to support the lavish lifestyle. And another 3% said that the reason for the divorce was because of the health and appearance. In a follow-up question on how the divorce was settled, 42% said that it was a civil divorce, while 34% said that it got ugly, and 24% said that the spouse literally took them to the cleaners. So we need to learn something from this. You're more likely as a truck driver to get a nasty divorce over a civil one, because if you compile the data, 42% of the drivers were civilly separated, while 58% it got ugly and she took him to the cleaners. Another thing, try to remember to spend a little bit more time at home because it can literally save your marriage. Now that we got the divorce out of the way, let's get into stats on income and passive income amongst truck drivers. What percent of truck drivers have passive income and what kind of passive income do they have? So in our first poll, 1,700 drivers participated and here's what we found out. 53% of all truck drivers that participated in this poll do not have passive income. 25% of those truck drivers currently own stocks, 12% have rental income properties, 5% have an online hustle, and another 5% receive interest on money saved. Now, when you ask drivers, what do they believe is a successful truck driver? I mean, think about it. Ask another driver, how do they view a successful truck driver? So here's what the poll said. How do they measure a successful truck driver? From 1,800 people that participated in this poll, 53% answered, a successful truck driver is one who has has passive income and works when he or she wants to work. 30% answered that a successful truck driver is one that has enough money to pay his or her expenses at the end of the month. 12% said that one who has multiple trucks or a small fleet is a successful truck driver. And 6% said that a successful truck driver is one that has his or her own authorities. So about three months ago, I got four of the most competitive companies out there and I built a link here on this YouTube channel and I asked drivers that if you need financing to fill out this form, this form is gonna to go to four different companies and they're gonna compete for your business. Believe it or not, I went to that link on our website for financing. You know, the handy one that Ronan tells us about, it goes to four different people and then blah, 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 blah. So what happened? Believe it or not, that's the one I used. Um, very simply, um, I went to the link, put my information in. Now Ronan says it takes 20 seconds. It didn't take 20 seconds, it took 30 seconds. So 30 seconds in, um, put the pertinent information in, very simply, it went off. Where it goes, I don't know. I'm not a technological genius here. I don't have a clue where the hell it went. It went out in there to the finance world. Now, let's get into our next topic, engines, transmissions. Drivers love talking about engines and transmissions, but whenever you bring up fuel consumption, they hate talking about it. So here's a poll from 2,100 truck drivers that took part in this poll. What do drivers believe is the best engine brand while taking into account durability, cost, and repairs. So we'll go from the least most popular to the most popular. So 2% voted on the International Navistar, 5% voted on the Packard MX-13, 9% voted on the Volvo DD-13, 32% voted on the Detroit DD-15, and 52% said that the most reliable engine is the Cummins X-15. Now that we know from 2,100 drivers what is the most reliable engines in their view, let's talk a little bit about 
about transmissions. 2,200 drivers participated in this poll. How many drivers prefer automatic versus transmissions? Well, 54% answered that they prefer automatics over the manual transmission, and 46% prefer the manual transmission. And lastly, fuel consumption. 1,500 truck drivers were asked about fuel consumption, and here's what they said. 24% said that they get between five to six miles per gallon, and 22% said that they receive between six to seven miles per gallon. 18% said that they receive between seven to seven and a half miles per gallon. 16% said that they get seven and a half to eight miles per gallon. And 21% of the drivers said that they receive between eight to nine miles per gallon. So to sum it up, 46% of all drivers that took part in this poll said that they get under seven miles per gallon when driving their truck. All right, last topic. Let's talk about pain. What kind of body pain do truck drivers mostly suffer from? So a poll was conducted between 1,500 truck drivers, and here's what they had to say. 67% of truck drivers suffer from lower back pain. 12% suffer from neck pain. 9% suffer from shoulder pain. 7% said they suffer from upper back pain. And 5% suffer from pain in their feet. So what do truck drivers like to watch? Let's answer this question in the comments down below so I can create another video on the most popular videos that drivers like to watch. So option number one would be money and pay comparison videos. Option number two are engine and transmission videos. Option number three are truck reviews videos. Option number four are consolidated pay statement videos. And option number five is new driver training videos. So just write in the comments number one, two, three, four, five, whatever you would like to see more videos on. Now, if you don't already know this, this channel is all about trucking. Our most popular playlists are trucking industry issues, our pay comparison videos, and advice from truckers. Our three presenters are myself, Ronan, VP of operations here at ET Transport, Dean, who is our old school bodybuilder truck driver, and Liam, who brings us up to date on all the latest news. So if you're not already subscribed, make sure you're a subscriber to this channel. So next time we bring out a video, you'll get notified. I'm Ronan, and I'll catch you in my next video video.